Okay. I apparently got something way too amazing and I got disconnected. Hope everyone, welcome back to Flows Games and welcome back to Shop Titans. If, if my voice sounds a little bit weird, I'm currently under the weather due to allergy bullshit. But either way, in the previous episode, we did something that I probably don't remember because it's been a good few weeks and or months since I've done the last episode. So let's just continue from where we left off. I definitely know of a couple new things that have come up since then. One is obviously the King's Caprice's background. Fire Nation armor? I can make Fire Nation armor? Why did no one tell me? Why has that never appeared here? I'm upset. Another thing is, um, recently, the release anniversary of Shop Titans had just come in. Log in every day from June 12th to June 19th to receive gifts. This episode is probably coming out a good bit after that, most likely. So yeah, we've gotten 50, 75, 100, 150 gems. What are these final three going to be? Probably statues of some kind. We had also managed to save up enough money to get the next location unlocked, which is the Kronos Ruins, which we were able to start and get. I don't want to say we didn't get Ancient Marble. We just um, we sent one crew out there, including our two new recruits, Nolan and Isabel. I kept saying Isabel. It is not Isabel. It is just Isabel. But either way, since then, things have taken a pretty bad dive for the guild. Because a lot of people had either left or been kicked. Um, I believe Desica over here, she was originally the guild master. She demoted herself to officer and made King Mud the guild, ma the guild master. I'm going to be honest. I don't know. Unless we get a lot more people, I don't know if I'm going to be able to stay in the guild. I, I do not know. Because now the maximum that you can level them up to right now is 25. And I have others who are at 29. So I need this to be level all the that one to be to the next level. And then to the level after that in order to level them up past that. Now we could go to the Kronos Ruins right now and just check it out. But I think first instead, I got a good few chests that I want to unlock. Including a very interesting chest toward the end. But unless I get a blueprint or like a rare like piece of equipment i'm more than likely just gonna skip over it so uh how many i got two of these chests let's see if i let's see if i manage to get the final blueprint no we do not all right i got five of these ones maybe a blueprint in here epic tomahawk Repair kit? Repair kits are always good. And nothing else. Why loot coins? Oh, that's something else I should probably do. Alright, there really wasn't much of anything from these chests. I got two of these limestone chests. Maybe something in here. Nothing from these, except from some of these, but... Also, the, um, the Lost City of Gold event did come and go. So, we're gonna open six of these and see maybe if we can get any of these blueprints, because these seem to be far more common. What have we got? This one I might actually stick through. And this is why! An epic royal halberd. Cedar resistance. Super loot bugle. Golden chuck. I th wait, I thought they were called golden artifacts. I guess they're called golden chunks now. Epic lizard spirit. Superior samurai, that's a word, Hidate. XP drinks and silver compass. Superior samurai kabuto. Yami coins, I can level her up now. Superior, uh, super XP booster. Cedar power. Silver compass. Golden chunks. Sanction shards. XP drink. Golden chunks. Cedar vitality. 
Blood Runestone. Research Scrolls. One last one. Maybe here. Legendary Owl Spirit. Goddamn. Golden Chunks. Phoenix Feather. Always good. Seed of Power. Okay. We did also complete a good few of, like, the Flash Quests. Where we can fight someone and get chest, and then fight someone else and get keys. The higher their difficulty, the higher kind of chest. So we're able to open four of these um, time worm chests. So, oh no, wait, what? Wait, wait, wait a minute, what? Okay, I'm confused as to why they show me the time worm chest first. Who cares? Because I forgot we had ancient chests. Let's open the ancient chests. A flawless celestial staff. That's probably the best thing we got out of these things. Okay, now the time worm chest. I don't know why it was ordered that way. Oh, Rudo coins. We can now level him up too. Super loop eagle. Superior moonstone. Three stamina drinks. I will take that. All right, what else? More Yami coins, all right then. Overgrown Vine, Ascension Shards, and Kronos Crystals. Okay, I apparently got something way too amazing and I got disconnected. Uh, uh, okay, weird. I, f I forgot if that was from that chest or the one before it. Okay, so it was from the one before it. That was insanely weird. Let's try that again. Wow! Ancient Marble made the game disconnect. And a super power booster. Okay, never mind. That, that can make it disconnect! Legendary Shark Spirit? Hey, yo! And a Kronos Crystal. Yo. But that's not where it ends. Because this thing, however... These are minor artifact chests. These things... I guess these were given as, like, a gift for those who are still around since the, um... Since, uh, what was it called? Like, the anniversary. So... There's a chance for three different blueprints. I have no clue what we're going to get. We have four keys and there's an infinite amount to open. So what can we even get from these? Let's see. Superior Moonstone, seven of them. Seed of Vitality, all right. Seed of Power. And Deteriorated Book. It's a component? Okay... Faded Cowl, also a component. So, <laughs> what are you? You're obviously an amulet of some fort, some some fort, some sort, with a name that I could not pronounce. Fire. Thank you, chest. Wow, I just heavily miscounted. Next. Rusted pickaxe. Okay. Faded cowl again. Deteriorated book again. And flawed runestones. These are obviously things needed to make these things that are in the blueprints. Tell me I'm going to get at least one of the blueprints. Please. XP Drink, Super XP Booster, Superior Moonstone, I don't even get one of the blueprints, I don't even get one of the blueprints, that's stupid, but there are an infinite amount of them, I don't know if they're a limited time thing, and I can afford one opulent chest, fuck it, let's get it, alright, let's open an opulent chest, and maybe, just maybe, get one of the blueprints, 17 chiseled runestone 20 opulent jewel 
one super XP booster. And a mega loop bugle. That was a waste. But I'm going to go through some of that equipment I just got. This is all the equipment I just got. You are a tier 9 amulet. J you have corrupted affinity. That could come in handy should I have someone who needs corrupted affinity. You need an amulet though, however. And this is like a pretty powerful amulet, so screw it, you're gonna take it. I am gonna go ahead and replace it with the wild element we just got. But now that we've gone through that, let's see what it's like going to the Kronos Ruins and what the enemy even looks like. So what are we dealing with? Oh, it's a Cyclops thingy! Oh, he has power! But we're getting some good criticals off. Yeah, please attack her. Please don't attack him because he is... He, he, he's just a little boy. Uh, oh, please don't attack him. I don't want him to die. I need him to level up. So please have a heart. Somewhere in that weird centaur buff exterior. Okay, never mind. You couldn't find it in your heart, could you? Was it was that too much to ask? I don't say the background music is okay. Not as good as some of the other ones, but And he's dead. We got Wait a minute, is that? Wait a minute, what was that? That was Oh, we didn't even get it. We got we did get eight Raptoria. I definitely need to send a Polonia here at some point. Without a doubt. I need to send Polonia here. Actually, that I, that reminded me. I completely forgot to level up the guys who could level up. So let's go... Let's level up Argon first. He it looks like he's going to get get a new shield decal. And even more of that affinity. So now he has 45 of that sun affinity. And... Oh, oh rekindled. I could, not I could not read that for a moment. Requires Argon rank 8. I... Argon, what's the rush? Lilu, I'm going to be a paladin. Really? All right, so that. A paladin? Th that's amazing, Argon. How? The king told me to face a trial. That's the only way to, tr to truly be worthy of the title, paladin. A trial. Do you know what you will do? Uh... Oh, no. I have no clue. It has to be something epic in glorious proportions. But, Argon, you are glorious. You defeat a monster as far and wide. Sure, but it has to be something more. I've heard there are feathered demons at Bleak Spire Peak. Maybe that would do it. Well, whatever it is, I'm sure you're up for it. Thanks, Lilu. Even when I was no longer a knight, you kept believing in me. Oh, th that was nothing. You, you, did I see a little bit of a blush there, Lilu, with your little redheadedness? Anyway, you, you'll, anyway, you'll need help in your quest. I'll prepare a few healing scrolls for you. Amazing. Onward! Ten gems, I will definitely take that. Alright, next up, level up Lilu, who gets, it looks like it's a new, it looks like it upgrades her satchel and her boots, is that right? Oh, it upgrades her entire, it just upgrades her entire outfit, giving her some more stars, and some more water affinity. Okay, story, common cause requires Lilu rank 8. Mr. Rudo, please don't walk away, I need to talk to you. Beat it, kid, I don't want to hear it. You and your owl can go oh, you and your owl can go play elsewhere. I know you don't like spellcasters, but I really need your help. I need to go deep into the Kronos ruins. I just came from the Kronos ruins, and I can't go alone. Why don't you ask that kid Argon, your knight in shiny armor? He's uh busy with something else at the moment. Yeah, he's on a quest to Bleak Spire Peak. He is a better man than you ever will be. I guess there's no point in asking you then. You got that right, kid. That is truly a shame, hun. I heard the Kronos Ruins Cyclops Lord has never been defeated in single combat. She knows what she's doing. It would take an exceptional warrior to escort Lilu through these ruins. Never defeated, you say? Fine, I'll bite. How much smashing do I get to do? A lot, I'm sure. Uh, you see, I need to find the source of the time flux coming from various crystals and isolate. Cut it short. There are monsters and magical crystals to smash. Alright, sold. You owe me one, kid. 
Great, thank you so much, Mr. Rudo. Save it for after our trip, kid. It's no walk in the park. I'll be there to heal your wounds if you face too many monsters. Hmm, <laughs> not likely. And thank you too, Naya. Not a problem, hon. Naya knew exactly what she was doing. She knew exactly what she was doing. Alright, next up. Uh, let's do Yami. Alright, Yami, she gets... I think it looks like she gets new shoulder thingies. We have new shoulder thingies. And more corrupted affinity. Alright, story. Broken pawn requires Yami, rank 6. Alright, what have we got? Uh, a black wind betrays the stalker's presence. Huh? How? She who stalks steps as a feather, but heavy heart is laid bare to the third eye. Those are just a bunch of words. Enough charades, Oracle. I need answers. About the order. My family. A dealer in death comes demanding guidance. What does it offer in return? Your life. So be it. The Azuman order once concerned with righting wrongs. Champions of order turned slaves to the highest bidder. For an, for an insurmountable task, a pawn is sacrificed. In failure or success, both of the order emerges a victor. Impossible. The messenger has spoken. Impossible! The one who stalks the shadows must also make amends with light given time. Whatever you say, Miss Fortune Teller. Alright, now, Rudo. Rudo, what you got? Oh, Rudo gets a helmet! Yo, look at man's helmet! He got he got 15 uh flamey flame. Oh, I forgot. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, what's this? Okay, those are worth a lot, but what are they? These are Sakura cuffs. They have nature affinity. Wait, 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 wait. Which of my heroes needs gloves? You do not. Well, who has nature affinity that needs gloves? You. Nope. Those are gauntlets. Uh, nature, 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 nature. Na ah, you don't need gloves either. Dang it! We're back at the beginning. So those are really good gloves, but no one who has nature needs gloves or can even wear gloves, which is annoying. But I think we've done all we can in this episode so far, so you know what? This has been Flo's Games, this has been Shock Fans, and I hope to see you all in the next video.